Kenya and the US are bound by a shared culture of innovation. This is why our Silicon Savannah is globally recognized as a hotbed of innovative breakthroughs and a radical digital solution in our sectors. M-Pesa, for example, the revolutionary mobile money technology heralded Kenya's entry into fintech and the financial technology space. We therefore have a common foundation to empower our youthful population with skills in STEM, with particular emphasis on developing a robust capacity to engage with the global digital technology sector on a much and such advanced and emerging technologies as artificial intelligence, robotics, and data science. By following in the footsteps of the historic airlift, we shall empower a new generation of disruptive thinkers, ambitious visionaries, and innovative problem solvers, and thus divine a brighter knowledge-driven future where progress transcends borders, transforms lives, and delivers prosperity. Practitioners are ahead of the policymakers. In my proposal, I am concerned about the persistent underrepresentation of women in STEM, posing a grave challenge to inclusive development in other sectors. Despite evident progress, Kenya faces a significant gender gap in STEM at all levels, from education to the workforce. Our partnership must therefore be intentional about promoting women's participation in STEM. <laughs> the STEM mentorship program, implemented by UNESCO in collaboration with the government of Kenya and benefiting 2,000 young women, serves as a model that underscores the power of partnership. We are determined to leverage the Kenya-US partnership to empower and inspire greater female participation and leadership in STEM. In my midst, just to demonstrate, I have come with many women in my leadership, <laughs> in my administration. And in our... <laughs> I want to ask the women governors who are here, uh, the, the women governors who are here, those... Those three ladies are some of our foremost great leaders in Kenya, demonstrating the power of women leadership. Thank you very much. Let us therefore stand together in a common endeavor to build a bridge that will lead present and future generations to prosperity. Our commitment to empowering a new generation of leaders with the necessary competencies will ensure a bright future for both the US and Kenya. Additionally, through faculty and student exchanges, we stand to benefit immensely from deeper cross-cultural knowledge sharing, mutual understanding, and of course, solidarity among people. In essence, what we are doing today is laying a firm foundation for our shared values to make a significant contribution to building a freer, more democratic, secure, prosperous, and united world. I thank you.